Hey YouTube, it's me, Bougie Ass Boy. Um, as you can see, I'm in the hospital now. Um, my bed rest ended up going tragically wrong. Let me try to turn this volume down. Okay. Um, going wrong. Somehow I end up um, rupturing. Um, well, one of the baby's twins' water bag had a leak in it. Um, sometime last week, so I've been in the hospital now since Tuesday. Today is Friday, and I will be in the hospital for the remainder of the pregnancy. Um, as you know, this is my 23-week update with twin girls, which 23 weeks is not nothing, and it is extremely too early to be going in labor, so pretty much they have me on all kind of stuff hooked up to me. I'm trying to prevent the labor from going any further. Um, the goal is to at least uh, getting text messages from my aunt. <laughs> um, the goal is to at least get past. Um, the goal is to at least get past um, 25 weeks. We want to get past 25 weeks. I already have. Um, hold on, I'm trying to put my phone back on the charger. I already have um, had the steroid shots and put in to help the baby's lungs develop. Um, faster, um, and pretty much they're doing all they can to keep her in there and to grow a little bit more before they come out. I would definitely try my best to keep you guys updated while I'm in here. Um, I have to keep my legs elevated. So my bed is like leaning, like I'm about to go up, shoot out to a roller coaster and just drop down. Um, and my gestation of diabetes did come back, so I'm on a strict diet. I've been taking insulin, and it's just crazy. So imagine the next couple months sitting in this bed, going nuts already. So, um, can't even do a belly shot or any other kind of stuff right now. But, uh, sorry, guys. This is my only network to the outside where I'm almost my phone right now. <sighs> but, besides that, everything is going okay. Um, just wanna take all the prayers and all the support I can use right now to get through this and make sure my babies come out safe and healthy. You know, that's all I'm worried about right now is that they're going to be okay. So, um, that's pretty much what I wanted to give you guys an update on and let you know what's going on and how scary this is right now. Um, I'm actually. 23 weeks and today is Friday so 4 days 23 weeks and 4 days so you know 24 weeks will be a safer point but it's still too early 25 weeks is a lot better um worst case scenario they want me at 28 weeks and we're pushing for 35 weeks. If I can make it to 35 weeks, that will be the cutoff point. We'll definitely deliver at 35. Um, the earliest that they will want to is 28. And as long as I'm past 25, we're, we're a little better. You know, they always still have problems coming early, but we just want to get there, you know. So I'm on strict bed rest. I have 
catheter. I can't even get up to use the restroom. That's how bad it is. I can't move out of this bed. They have some little leg things on me, squeezing my legs to keep the circulation going to prevent me from getting blood clots. Excuse me. But being in a bed so long that um, I'm not going to be able to move. The scary part is hearing that you're going to have to learn how to walk again because laying down for months, you lose your muscles and things like that, which is scary. So I'll give up anything just for them to be okay. So if it takes for me to relearn how to walk or whatever just for my babies to come out and have a normal, healthy life, they can have them have these legs and everything else so um i guess i'll update you guys next week me too to let you know um how um i'm progressing and things like that but as for the babies um baby a pretty much her water is almost out you know she's pretty much in there hanging on but um Baby B water is still intact. She's okay. Everything's fine with her. We're just so worried about baby A right now. So the goal is to keep her in there, make sure we prevent any infections or anything that's going on. So they have me on all kind of antibiotics and different medications and stuff like that. So your prayers and um, everything right now will be most helpful. You know, just send out a prayer for the babies that they can wait and come out at the appropriate time. So, I'll catch you guys later, you too. Bye.